Hey guys, today we are going to show you how to start mining with NiceCash Miner and how to use our new NiceCash platform. First, you need an account and if you don't have one, you have to register. Click Get Started and you have to fill out this form. Now, I already have an account, so I will just log in. When you log in for the first time, this is how your dashboard will look like. You have to navigate to the mining section and here you have to click download miner. Now we assume you're using a PC or a mining rig with an, an, uh, AMD or NVIDIA uh, graphics cards. So just click nice cache miner. Click download and you will be transferred to our GitHub page. Now you have two options. You can either uh, download the installer version or the zip package one. Uh, we recommend using an installer version because it gives you a very convenient way of updating your nice miner once the new version is up. So I'm going to choose this version. Then you can start the installation process. Uh, click I agree and follow uh, the installation steps. Here um, we give you a uh, recommendation for whitelisting the location where an ice miner is installed, just in case if you get uh, any notification from any notifications from your antivirus software. Click finish and an ice miner will start. You have to accept our terms of use, choose language and click I agree or this disclaimer. Now NiceCache Miner will download all the necessary files for proper operation and we will continue when all the files are downloaded. Now we need a Bitcoin address. So you have to navigate back to your mining dashboard and here we can see that uh, we have to use this mining address we click copy and if you accidentally close this pop-up you can always go uh, here where your mining address is located. So just copy this address and paste it in this Bitcoin address field. You can also name your worker, I would just name it uh, Eric and now I can click start all. In the beginning uh, all your devices have to be uh, benchmark. This can take uh, a few minutes uh, depending on how many uh, GPUs or CPUs uh, you are using and uh, you can now go back to your rig manager. So rig manager is a section uh, where everything uh, regarding your mining operation will be shown. I can already see my rig has appeared in the, uh, my rig's uh, list. Here I can see the rig name, current status. Like I said, it's benchmarking currently. I can see the highest temperature, uh, current rig profitability. Uh, and I also have these buttons where I can stop or start the, the, the miner remotely. So I have this remote control uh, uh, functionalities. Here, is, uh, here are some additional uh, functions uh, that, uh, that you can do, um, but mainly this is an area where you will be able to control everything regarding your mining rigs. If I click on this, uh, on this tile, I get all the details about my devices. So I can turn off or on a specific devices. Um, and here I can also enable CPU mining. So if I go back to Rig Manager, I see uh, the list of my rigs. I currently have only one. You can have as many rigs as you want uh, and everything is free. So uh, you don't have to pay anything to uh, add multiple rigs. Uh, this, will, uh, this section will turn green once everything is completed and the devices are mining. Here you can see the current profitability for all your rigs combined, your unpaid mining balance. Once you reach 1000 Satoshis, you will get 
payout and payouts happen every four hours. And now we can already see that my rig is mining. So I see that everything is working correctly. Again, I can check all the details, uh, all the details here. I can also navigate to history and stats section where all my uh, all my data about my mining process is available. If I go back to, back to my desktop, I can now see this black window. This is completely normal. This means that uh, miners are doing. Are, are hashing and now you are uh, sending all your results to nice hash uh, servers uh, basically selling your computing power and you are going to get paid big money. So make sure you subscribe to our channel, uh, leave a comment below and see you in the next